Credit and debit cards, part two. What's on a credit card? On the front of every credit card is a number. This number can either be 16 or 15 digits long. The number identifies your account so the banks will know where to change the money. There's also an expiration date. This signifies when your card will expire. On the bottom of the card is the cardholder's name. On more recent cards, you can find a small chip embedded in the card called an EMV, or smart chip. This can be used to store the cardholder's information. All the data stored is encrypted and can only be read by approved card readers. On the back of the card, there is a security code that is either three or four digits long. This protects against credit card fraud. There's also a magnetic strip. This is the traditional way of storing information. In addition, there's also a signature bar. You should always sign here whenever you get a new card. Debit card security. To protect your debit card, take the following precautions. Treat your card like cash. Report a stolen or lost card at once. Keep all your receipts. Cut up unused debit cards. Avoid strong magnets and safeguard your PIN. To earn financial certifications, visit www.fifpack.com and check out the books that these videos are based off of. Thanks for watching. Feel free to check out our other videos.